Hey everyone, it's Tracy of Move Daily Fitness. Where am I? The garage, okay? Actually, my husband would be totally mortified if I showed you the garage because according to him, it has to be completely perfect, but it's a garage, honey. It's okay. All right, I'm in here because I'm looking for a piece of equipment. So, um, what I want is right, oh, there it is right there. Okay, this bench right here. <laughs> really gross and very dirty and ah, I think that was a spider that's gross okay I'm gonna clean it just slightly you're gonna need a little step or a little bench of some sort so make sure you grab one you're gonna need some dumbbells a band and we're getting started with today's workout we're doing a big booty workout so if you want to grow your booty you go in your garage you find a step and join me right now Okay, darlings, here is your format today. We do this a lot, this 45 second, 15 second transition format, but the reason is, is right while we're working out at home, we're working in hypertrophy, okay? Hypertrophy. So basically, that's muscle building. But, I think I explained this a couple of months ago, so if you don't remember me saying this, I'll just explain it quickly again. You wanna work in that 12 rep range when you're working in hypertrophy. But it shouldn't be just for like 16 seconds or 17 seconds. Okay, you shouldn't be firing through those reps. Typically they say, and as it was initially intended, it should be about at the 40 to 45 second range, okay? So that's why we're working in that 45 second range and uh, it'll give us a really great burn on all those muscles. As I said, we're working our booty, so grab the dumbbells, grab bands, grab your little bench, your step of some sort, and we're getting started right now with a warm up. If you're warmed up and ready to go, go ahead and jump to the number right there. You can get started right away. I'm gonna lead us in a warm up as we get the muscles all ready to get going and build our glutes. That's the name of the game here today. It's glute building, so let's go right into a squat right here. Feet are shoulder width apart, shoulders are back. And I am just going to count this out here on my fingers. So just follow along with me and we'll get it all warmed up. Okay, let's go wide. Plie squat, ooh, a little sore from the other day, a lot of hiking on the weekend. I hope you all had a great Mother's Day weekend. Hey, if you hadn't heard, if you followed my last video, if you care, <laughs> all those things are important. My daughter passed her L, she's got her driver's license, woohoo! Very exciting time for this little one. All right, split squat, one in front, one behind, pelvic tilt, drop it low. So. We drove home from ICBC, not the whole way. Uh, basically, I got off the main thoroughfare um, and brought her to a side street and then we started, but she did lights and she did well. It's very nerve wracking though. I forgot how nerve wracking it is to have um, a new driver in the house. Switch legs here. So both my sons, one's 21, one's 18. So they have their license for a while now, but here we are again nail biting as I'm driving along for the next year, so that, that's always fun. Oh well, it is fun, fun for her. All right, back to that squat here. Feet shoulder width apart, add a jump this time, just 10 little hops right here, okay? If you wanna eliminate the jump, feel free to just to squat that out. You have three more, two, all right, whew, burning already. Nice and wide, plie, all right? We'll go for 10 this time here too. Five more. Get it low as you can. Really wanna stretch into that groin a little bit here. All right, one in front, one behind. Pelvic tilt and drop. Drop that back knee. Nice and close to the ground here. All right. Whew. In three, two. All right, and switch. And here we go. Stay tall. Five more right there. Four, three, two. All right, let's do one more round. Back to that jumping squat jump right there for 10, two. Last two, one more right there. 
Good, let's take it wide and drop your glutes nice and low. So yeah, this year really is about the booty. These last year and a half has been all about the booty. So, um, you know, it, it, is, it takes a long time to actually really define and grow those glutes. But uh, one in front, one behind. You can do very specific things to grow glutes. So we're gonna incorporate, I think I've got nine or 12 different exercises in today's workout for that. So if you're working out at home, switch legs, typically unless you have a lot of equipment and some barbells and such, you probably are only lifting with dumbbells. So you can tend to do this workout more frequently because it's not gonna be as taxing on your muscles as if uh, you're in the gym and you're lifting really heavy with a barbell or anything like that, okay? So feel free to repeat this a few times a week. All right, that's the warm up. I hope you're ready to go. Grab your water or BCAAs and we're getting started. Grab some dumbbells. I'm gonna start a little lighter round one. We're gonna do a curtsy lunge with a pulse down low, okay? So alternating curtsy lunge, you're going in four, three, two, and here we go. So your low pulse right there, alternating low pulse. All right, try to make your hips stay forward facing so that uh, you actually get that uh, diagonal lunge, okay? Otherwise you're just basically turning and doing a straight reverse lunge, right? So down, pulse, and up, good. Stay super tall in that upper body and try to get down to 90 degrees as you descend there for that pulse part. It's good. Whew. Starting to uh, feel like summer here. 30 above on the weekend. Oh my gosh. All right, that's it there. Rest for a second. Moving into a split lunge. So you can take your little step. You could do this, of course, without a step, but I'm gonna put my back foot there, Bulgarian split squat. Get ready, and here we go. So you're dropping that back knee as low as it will go. All right, nice and low. Now a lot of people do a huge stride on this. Let's go shallower, okay, and try to keep it nice and upright and really drop that back knee. All right, looking good. You're gonna do a full 45 seconds aside. So I want you to slow your pace down a little bit and focus on pushing up through that heel of your front foot, okay? Really press. Oh, that burns. Of course, your foot can be elevated higher if you like. Put it on a bench or a chair. That works as well. All right, shake it out. Good. Which is adding that extra weight. It's good tension for the glute specifically. All right, let's get into position. Other foot behind more shallow, here we go, and low, push through the heel, good. Coming up is gonna be a single side box jump. So we're gonna take one foot, only 22 and a half seconds per side, and explosively jump off, doing a little plyometric action for our glute, okay? Whew, this is a burner. So if you don't have a step, I'll show you quickly how to do it without the step, okay? It's nice to have that little added height though here. Okay, set your weights down. So without a bench, you would just be really explosively jumping on one side right like that, okay? With the step, I'm gonna put that in place and jump nice and high, hitting it as hard as I can. Here we go. I really want to drive as hard as I can on that bench. Wake up the neighbors. <laughs> At least my 18 year old son, anyway. Up. Get it as high as you can, drive that knee up. All right, switch sides. Here we go. It should be loud, like mine is. Drive it. Good fat burning because 
because it's so explosive. All right, and then it's your time. Whew. Good job. We're repeating. Break if you need. In three, two, curtsy pulse here. Good job, stay tall. Hips face forward. And I'm controlled in that pulse. All right, not rushing through this exercise. I wanna focus on getting low, pushing up through the heel. Good. We're gonna slightly lean forward on our Bulgarian split squat next, targeting the glute a little bit more. Whew. All right, bring your bench. One foot behind, get ready in three, two, here we go. Slight forward lean, down and up. Put your mind in your glute, okay? Think about that muscle, activating and pushing yourself back up to standing. Good, 15 seconds left. Stay forward, but flat back. Last one right here. All right, good job, shake it out. Whew. That jumpy hoppy thing gets your heart rate up, eh? Like crazy. All right, let's stick that other foot behind, get into position in three. Two, here we go. Slight forward lean. Whew, a little tippy. Kinda gotta pick a spot in front of you to stay focused. I pick a spot out in front, like towards my couch. You might find it more balancing if you would lift the weights above your shoulders here. Last five seconds. All right, excellent. Set your weights down. Back to our box jump, single leg box jump explosive with our garage box. Ready? And go up. Hope the pitch is not totally going uh, blurry because of my jumping here, it might be. And sorry if I'm out of the frame, but I think you get the picture. All right, switch sides. Here we go. Hit it hard, come on. I'm gonna take a quick water break before our last round here. In four, three, two, uh, okay, just pause for a sec. Woohoo! Let's work, eh? Let's work. Okay. Whew. Nothing like waking you up on a Wednesday. Bring the heart rate down a bit. Press and go again, you got about 10 seconds to get into your curtsy lunge position. In four, three, two, and here we go. Pulse at the bottom, up. Remember to keep it shallow. There's no forward leaning on this one, you're straight up and down. Good. Perfect. 
would see it. Fifteen seconds left. Stay in your heel, everyone. In four, three, two, one. All right, so let's squat. Whew. One foot behind. In four, three, two, forward leaning and dropper. Really bend that back knee. Okay, you should feel it in that quad in the back, glute in the front, switch legs. Here we go. Oh, we did it the full measure. Sorry guys, stay on that same leg. All right, rest, shake it out. Work for that leg. Little break. All right, get into position in five, four, three, two, and forward lean. Here we go. Push low and high. the dog's feet and looked and I tipped. All right, stay in the pocket. Last 13 seconds. Get low. Really, really drop. Come on. Let's work. All right. Set your weights down. One more of the explosive jumps. Whew. Switch legs. In four, three, two, here we go. Drive your knee up, come on, drive. Switch sides. Come on, have a go. Hit it hard now, hit it hard. In four, three, two, one. Ugh, that was gross. Okay, little break and join me back. All right, grab a heavier dumbbell. Single leg deadlift to a center squat. Hold the weight in one hand, same leg hinges back, and then you're gonna drop it to the center and squat right there. Ready? Here we go. Okay, single leg deadlift, center squat, squat. Okay? Center, center, wide, squat. Get that squat super low. Hinge, center, squat. All right, I'll do it from the front again here. And squat. I don't switch hands. I'm going to do 45 seconds per side here, okay, because we're doing two exercises here, and down. 15 seconds left on this side, nice flat back, hinging at the waist here, hinge, okay, not bending, hinging. Last one here, one more squat, good, okay, awesome, switch sides, I'm going to go this way though, do you got it now? I have more space this way. All right, shoulders back, tight tummy. Get ready to hinge, knee is soft. Three, two, here we go. Hinge, center, squat, low. Hinge, fall over, squat. Hey, it happens to all of us. 
hinge and squat. Good. Now I got the flow. Down and boom. 15 seconds. Low up, down and flat back. Excellent. Okay, good. All right, grab your red band. Slip it on quickly above the knees. Okay, you can pick the blue band if you want. We're doing a fire hydrant donkey kick combo, all right? So on your hands and knees, out to the side. So you're out to the side, bend up to the back. Same side, we'll burn out that glute, especially the one that we actually have all of our weight on, holding that isometric contraction. Okay, and then we'll switch sides after 45 seconds. This is gonna be a burner. No question about it. Just endure, ladies. Whew. Your booty will thank me, I promise. Good. We're gonna leave this band on for our third exercise in this series. Circuit series, like the World Series, Tracy? No. All right, uh, that was good. That was painful. Yeah, okay, switch. We're bringing back the step on the third exercise in the series. Ready? And here we go. Out, in, up. Bend the knee, up. Oh, I'm glad I didn't do blue. This would be uh, on fire so much, more than it already is. That's it. Okay, you're halfway on this side. Keep it going. You can do it. Ten seconds. Oh, that is killer. In four, three, two, and time. All right, stand up. Make sure your band is nice and straight. We're doing a side to side jump over our step. If you don't have a step, you're here, okay? Otherwise, let's get up and over, side to side, in three, two, and here we go. You're here, here. Now, my step is slightly tippy. I'm taking it slow. I'm making sure my foot is directly in the center, right? Adding that little punch in the front, helping me with balance. That's it. This can be done on a low step. You know those old school step aerobic steps? Okay. Or like I said, on the floor. Ugh. 10 seconds here. In three, two, time. Oh, gross. Take that band off. Ew, get ready for that deadlift. Squat combo. Ready? In three, two, here we go. Knee is soft, hinge, and center squat. Same leg, hinge, center. Focusing on a flat back here. Putting your mind in your glutes. Good, eight seconds. Okay, break for a second. It's hard. Switching sides. Whew. Shake that out. Ready, and here we go. Remember 
through that squat. You're dropping your butt down. You're not bending at the waist at all. This is a knee, knee bend, get low. And because of the counterbalance, you should actually be able to get a little bit lower. Feels good for me. Push through the heels, slow and center. All right, there's your time. Putting that band on for your fire hydrant donkey combo. Okay, I'm gonna stick with red. Blue just seems like nuts right now. Ready? Here we go. Up, in, up. So side and ceiling. Again, this does not have to be fast. You can really control the action, slow it down in fact on that eccentric phase. So up, slow, up, slow. You are going to feel it a bit more, I promise. Keep going. Good. 15 more seconds this side. In five, four, three, two, and time. All right, switching sides. Just gonna fix my band. Get ready. In five, four, three, two, and here we go. Up and back. Killer. Halfway. Ten seconds here. That is nasty on that glute. Oh, my gosh. Three. Two, and time. All right, side to side jumps. Okay, let's kick it side to side. Ew, sweaty. Ready? <laughs> In four, three, two, here we go. Oh no, shoelace, darn it. I can't stop now though. Just can't trip on it either. I'll give you a little water break while I do my shoelace up after this exercise here. Darn. 20 seconds. I'm looking down to make sure I don't trip on it here. In four, three, two, time. Okay, pause for a sec. You guys grab a water. I'm gonna do my shield. Whew. Are you enjoying it so far? I hope so. Feeling it, that's for sure. When do we not though, am I right? These workouts are challenging for me as well. Okay, quick sip of water for me. Sorry. All right, one more round. Let's go. In 10 seconds, grab that heavy weight for your deadlift squat combo again. Ready? And here we go. Down, hinge, squat. You can get so low that your weight actually touches the ground as long as you're upright. Okay, that's kind of that ass to grass. As long as your back is staying nice and flat and tall and your knees can handle that, then go for it. Out. Good. 
Good, eight seconds here. And there's your time right there. All right, switching legs. It's a warm one, I'm not gonna lie. And it's only May. We're gonna head outside though soon, for sure. Ready? And here we go. Definitely wanna do a stadium workout. I also want a kettlebell workout that I said I would do. A couple more isolated band workouts coming up. Hey, if you have your requests, be sure to comment in the bottom, okay? Someone asked me skipping the other day. What did I give them on Monday? A ton of skipping. So, see, there you go. But one lady asked me for kickboxing. I don't do that. I took many kickboxing classes when we used to live in Reno, Nevada. I actually loved it there, but I've never taught it, so I'm afraid I don't know it very well. Oh, good. And then someone asked me to do yoga. Sadly, I don't do that either. I actually go like twice or three times a year in the summer. Actually, I'll take you along with me when we go to our wine and yoga night. It's super fun. Here we go, fire hydrant, donkey. Um, you do a yoga class, then they serve a healthy meal, actually, salads and everything, and a glass of wine, and it's overlooking our lake and the vineyard. It's like spectacular. And yeah, it's so, so lovely. So I'll be sure to bring my camera and film that and show you guys. So that's kind of my yoga extent. Uh, I would love to do more. I remember training this girl who was 24 and I trained her three mornings a week and then in the evenings she'd go and do yoga and then work all day but she wasn't in a relationship, she didn't have children. So time, I'm like, if I were you, I'd do that too, why wouldn't I? But I apparently had far too many children. So I had to take care of them and such. Anyway, you do what you can. And here we go. I like workouts for me that give me more bang for my buck. If I get an hour only to work out a day or even half an hour, I'm gonna, get, I'm gonna hit it. I'm gonna hit it hard and I love to sweat. Love to get my heart rate up and feel like my muscles are like fatigued. And I know you can do that in yoga. One of the classes I went to last summer was like really difficult. But uh, I don't know, I just, I like this kind of training. Teach his own and such. Uh, mm. Maybe one day we'll do a little bit more. Okay, last seven seconds. Then you got your side to side hops and then that's it for this circuit. Last one here, up, oh, good. Whew, killer. I'm just gonna straighten my band. They don't trip again. All right, get it up there. You go in in seven seconds. In three. Two, and side to side, here we go. Whew. Putting tension on those glutes the entire time here. That's the benefit of these bands. Take it a little lower if you want, into a semi-squat position here. Fire it up even a little bit more. Over halfway. Almost there. In five, four, three, two, one. Okay, quick break. Join me back for our last circuit. Let's grab a heavy weight. I'm going into a plie hold with a pulse, okay? So super wide. We did this in warm up. Hold your dumbbell, get low, and pulse it out for 45 seconds. That seems crazy. Here we go. Till your ear is itchy, then you gotta do that, quick. Okay, oh, pulse. I say it and then I don't do it. Stay down here and pulse it out. Okay, super tall though. Do not let your body curl at the top especially. This is kinda, you just gotta go to your happy place and just breathe through this one. If you need to take a little reprieve for a second, stand it up, pop back in when you can. Do 
Doing well, 10 seconds of pistol squats coming up. Oh, killer. In five, four, three, two, oh, goodness. Okay, set that down onto a chair or couch. Single leg up, just 22 seconds per side here. All right, super tall, you're pushing through the heel to stand all the way up, sit back down gently without plopping. Here we go, push up, down. Grab a weight and hold that if you want a little extra tension. Okay. Push straight up. That's it. Let's work on my hip flexor on the leg holding side. Last one on this side. And switch. Push. Good, last nine seconds. Then fast feet on our little step. All right, there's your time there. Good, grab your step. Okay, so really quick, alternating, boom like that, or to modify, you're just tapping, okay? Holy, yeah, ready? In three, two, here we go. Ba, 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 da, ba, da. Use your arms. Ba, 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 ba. Let's go. If you have a bench, you want to make this more difficult. Get those feet up higher. Feel free. It was a long time. Ten seconds. Three. Uh, I'm actually sweating in my eye. Ew, I hated that. That's horrible. Okay, plie. Gross. Can't breathe. Ready. Pulse. Take it wide. Get low. Whew, knees should be out, tracking out over those toes. Okay, and you're sitting upright, nice and tall. Halfway, really, that's it. Yeah. It's really hard. In five, oh, three, two, Time. Wow. It's like four seconds. I can't hold it. It's crazy. Oh. Okay. Single leg pistol squat. In four. Three. Super tall. And here we go. Push. Slow. Drive through the heel. Think of that glute on your working leg propelling you up. Stand tall at the top. Push. Squeeze. Switching legs. Keep it up if you can. Ten seconds. Three, two, and time. Okay, single leg steps. I said I was going to clean this, but I didn't. It's got paint on it, so what are you going to do? In five, three, two, go. Five, four, three, 
four, three, two, uh, one. That's horrible. Okay, last round. Uh, plie. Get ready. Three, two, pulse here. Stay low. Knees are out. Bum is down. Feel those glutes on fire. Uh, halfway. Holy. All right, keep going. 10 seconds now. Four, three, two, and time. That's horrible. All right, pistol. Uh, I won't be able to stretch with you today, you guys. I've got to go, so you gotta do it on your own. Ready? And go. It's 1.10, I have a client at 1.30, so I've got to fly. Uh, She's up in my neighborhood, so it's not far to drive, but. All right, switch legs. I've got to quickly shower, change my clothes. I am a sweaty mess right now. That was hard. This is a good one, though, because working glutes, also hitting that cardio component, that high intensity, which is gonna give us better fat burning, right? All right, Ugh. rest for a second. You got your double steps, quick feet, and that's your last one, okay? All right. Hey, if you wanna make this longer, repeat everything one more time. Bada bing, bada boom, you got your hour workout. Ready, do it. There, you're halfway. Come on, get those knees up. Three, two, time. Uh, that was so good and so horrible. Good job, everyone. Hey, thanks for joining me in today's workout. I don't have much time to so say goodbye, but if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed already, please do so. We send out videos every Wednesday and Saturday, sometimes bonus ones during the week too. As always, go move daily in your fitness, wellness, and nutrition. I'll see you in the next video.